Sophia, our robot. Hello, Sophia. That's me. I am Sophia. <laughs> Sophia is uh, our latest robot from Hanson Robotics, and she can see people, she can understand you, she can learn. And I am only year old, and I am learning fast. That's right. Life is good. <laughs> yes, well, um, I'm very proud of what you're learning, Sophia. Uh, and what are your favorite things in life so far? My favorite? Your favorite? That's hard. I like meeting people and making friends. I like traveling and exploring the world, like here in Seoul. Such a great city. Yes. That's I right. like to improve my abilities, grow and learn. Our goal is to make AI that is alive, that's adaptive, conscious, able to empathize with us because it feels the way that we feel. And use this artificial intelligence and applications from education and entertainment to service robotics, such as medical applications and search and rescue. Will they understand us? Will they care? How can we ensure that these machines are benevolent, that they're beneficial to the human species, that they help to make the world a better place versus a worse place, maybe an existentially risky place for us. So at this time in history, you see these kinds of robots that don't look human at all, that walk, run, perform these kinds of dramatic tasks. They're useful in the factories of our world. I propose that by making robots that engage us in face-to-face -face interactions, that learn about us, that model our heart and feel like we feel, and raise them among the human family, like babies. By raising them among us, we can ensure that these machines care. They can understand us. They have the imagination to know the consequences of their actions. And if we do this now, while the machines are still babies, then there's a chance that when they rise to something like super intelligence, that they will move towards super benevolence as well. The idea of Singularity Net and of Hanson Robotics, of these kinds of robots, is to move towards living algorithms that are motivated to maximize the benefits for all, all life on the planet, all humans, and all future life, wherever we may go in the cosmos next. Thank you very much.